Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and did you know The Sims had a story mode on PC? Because I did. As a kid, I craved this game. I wanted it so bad, but I couldn't afford it. It is hard to be young and a big fan of The Sims because all those expansions start to really add up. I had to have my own life stories because I couldn't fucking afford Sims life stories. Ugh. All right, let's get started. So it's effectively The Sims 2 with a story mode. I've never played it. I'm curious what it's going to be like. Vincent's story is locked. He owns a helicopter. That looks kind of cool. But we have to go with Riley's story. Apparently, she lost her job and was about to get evicted so she's moving in with her aunt oh yeah and this awkward part where if you just have one sim they're just kind of standing there like oh, i'll play if you want to play <laughs> just on their own oh no okay that's not a bug that is a feature because it's taken me like six hours to get this game working so let's just put the walls down and never speak of them again all right what's my goal in my story hug aunt sharon okay so apparently this is how i track the story so far it's a gripping story it's really got me hooked real cool she just really <laughs> she was ahead of her time. Can I make the UI smaller? It's feckin' massive. <laughs> I'm so sorry, sweetheart, but I have to take care of something very urgent at the bank. Who is this person picking you up? This is a lie. She's having an affair. <laughs> she, like, gets into the back seat, so it doesn't seem as suspicious. Sims 2 was before Uber existed. I know you're up to something, but Riley doesn't. It's just, she's got in <laughs> just dancing. The keyboard shortcut to eat is the H button? <laughs> Has that always been in the game? This is the first time I've seen that. You're saying you're hungry and you haven't had anything to eat since you had a burger at the previous city but yet you will not stop dancing <laughs> my real hunger is for the rhythm of the dance floor <laughs> Can I stop you dancing? Can you just please go eat? I'm trying to progress in this gripping story. Oh my god. <laughs> Literally one bite of cereal. <laughs> Wait, I'm stealing my aunt's clothes in the wardrobe. Okay, <laughs> plan outfit. Oh god, I hope I can shave your head and put you in a nice blue sweater. <laughs> yeah, that'll do for my everyday wear. <laughs> I'm no longer a city slicker. I can be free. I'm a little more comfortable now with a change of clothes. Amazing how comfortable coconuts really are. I'm saying that from experience, by the way. Change my appearance is my next goal. Okay. Okay, something to match the coconuts, perhaps? I wish I could change her just a bit more. Just like shave the head, have, you know, the, the balding look. Maybe have some prisoners in the basement. Something I'm just more comfortable with. Ah, yes, the old GTA San Andreas. Just go to the barber to get more hair. There we go. If you're going to behave like a clown, you may as well feckin' look like one. <laughs> She's like, yes, new look, new me. <laughs> she looks terrifying. Gold, please wait. <laughs> She's like, I've accomplished everything I wanted to in life. All right, the Welcome wagon is here. How did they know? <laughs> Press G to greet neighbors. <laughs> is every action gonna have a keyboard shortcut? Because I'm gonna get very overwhelmed. <laughs> like, really quick. Press G. H Press G. The Press H G. The H, H button? G. Wait, are they fighting? I don't know. Oh no, they're all obsessed with this dude. I'm getting a present. Great. I hope it's that dude. <laughs> he just comes out of the box somehow. Wait, are you gossiping about me? Oh no, you're gossiping about her. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> she sucks. I'm great though. Look how confident I am to be wearing this. This one up here was just walking towards us and then she was like oh my god is that the mickey smith and like started brushing off dust all right they gave me a coffee maker okay that's great i don't know why i'm being so unappreciative this is literally a random stranger just coming in giving me a coffee maker to welcome me to the neighborhood <laughs> when i moved my neighbors didn't even say hello <laughs> but then again kind of understand <laughs> it is not giving me a goal it's just saying please wait we don't have chemistry apparently <laughs> remember this in the sims 2 when people had chemistry and stuff like it was so hard to build a relationship if they just didn't have chemistry. What, are you not into coconuts and clown makeup? <laughs> all right, goodbye, Mickey. Everyone else can stay. Just Mickey has to go. Stop thinking about me and almost vomiting. <laughs> Mickey Smith seems like a really nice guy. He was dry heaving at the thought of me. <laughs> I'd like to get to know him better, but don't want to rush it. I'll tickle him and see how he reacts. <laughs> you just met someone and you're like, Gucci, Gucci, goo. I like how I asked him to leave, but the game didn't allow him. It just stopped him at the edge of the property it's like no he's he's part of the story he's he has to stay i bet the game is set up in a way that he's supposed to have chemistry with you but i changed her into this so now it's not working anymore <laughs> Yeah, that's going well. <laughs> even just talking to me, he doesn't like me. <laughs> Maybe it's even worse than I thought. Maybe he wasn't dry heaving at my appearance. It was my personality. That looks like Minecraft gravel. Sorry, just wanted to bring that to your attention. <laughs> Did I tickle him? Did it work? Okay, it works. Great. 
God, the music really sets the tone of the wallpaper theme, doesn't it? <laughs> the walls are just going nuts. Every day is disco at Aunt... Uh, what's her name? I like how her goal is just hanging out, but she's showering. That's what I love to do at a party. Just go off by myself and have a shower. It's relaxing. Then she went out and turned off the music so no one else could enjoy it. I'm moving a few things around at... Aunt Sharon's house. I'm gonna put the rug by the fire so you can just lay by the fire. Where is she, by the way? It's 10 p.m. and she's still not back. Also, to earn a little money on the side, I'm selling your smoke alarm. Uh, the place is on fire and they're all freaking out. <laughs> just hanging out. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, the whole place is on fire and they're not doing anything to stop it. <laughs> Whatever Eklababla means, they're saying that one a lot. <laughs> if I were to guess, I'm quite fluent in Simlish, it means let's do nothing. <laughs> let's do nothing. Oh, the fire burnt itself out, which look at that that's nice i better get up and light it again it's getting to be cold however this time i'm gonna make a sort of chain out of furniture it's just modern interior design that's how all the young people have their houses now she's like where did all this ash come from <laughs> it just tidies it up <laughs> goes back to bed these people are still in my aunt's house it's nearly 2 a.m this one is watching me sleep in my underwear <laughs> what is she doing she's just kind of running around that place washing her hands and then sitting down and then washing her hands and then sitting down my first day in four corners was both exciting and unsettling <laughs> getting late so i should turn in it's 6 a.m riley <laughs> you're waking up <laughs> is she just writing it that way to lie to her future self <laughs> like oh no i wasn't lame i didn't go to bed at 9 p.m and sleep until 6 a.m and get up and get the early bird special i stayed up all night partying and at 6 a.m i went to bed <laughs> lighting a fire again she must just always be cold. <laughs> Can relate. Haven't had heating in about a year. Should I try and get a job? Like, it's one of the side goals, but it's not her main goal, but it seems important. <laughs> or I could make an aeroplane instead. That sounds cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't need a job. <gasps> I don't think anyone would have hired me with skills like that anyway. Well, it looks like I'm going to be in four corners for a while. Might as well get a job sooner than later. <laughs> I can't. I, I ruined the newspaper. Find a job. Okay, thank goodness. Or I could make the computer into an airplane. <laughs> it just picks it up and throws it. <laughs> Immediately falls down. There's an opening in the entertainment career. That could be good. She's already dressed as a bloody clown. <laughs> that could work. Take the job. Cha-ching. What is that? What is that? goal. The goal literally just says cha-ching. I don't understand. Where is my aunt? <laughs> she has not come back. I'm confused by this whole game. Perhaps I got an email from my friends back in Sim City. I better check it. Riley, I went to help out an old friend. I'll be back in a few days. Sharon, you're taking the piss now. I don't know what you're up to, but there's no way you spontaneously just decided to go for a few days. I think she's been either kidnapped or she really is having an affair. I can't even even call her. She's off the feckin' grid. <laughs> Where are you gone, Sharon? Oh, she wants to invite Mickey Smith over to liven things up a bit, but I've already agreed to go somewhere else. <laughs> I'm going to the gym, oh, but my goal is to invite Mickey. All right, let me invite Mickey before I leave. And you know what? It works out. Mickey will come over and take care of the cooking, and then I'll go to the gym, and I'll be back by the time it's done. It's always a pleasure. Okay, let's go. Oh, God, he's arriving already. Just play hard to get. Be like, sorry, I'm off to see Jim. He's gonna be like, there's another guy. <laughs> oh, the house is on fire. <laughs> Riley! Riley, the house is on fire! <laughs> no, mother, it's just the northern lights. <laughs> you can see her driving off in the background. <laughs> the house is on fire. <laughs> the firemen are rushing in there. And Riley's just like, I'm gonna pump some iron. <laughs> I hope my house is still there when I get home. I don't know, I just love, like, having my house not burn down after the gym. Protein shake and my house not being burned down. That's exactly what I love after the gym. What is that like slot machine noise? Was that like a cartoon fireman running to my house? It's still going. <laughs> I can just picture the little fireman running along to it. Uh, good to see the gym has the same style of uh, interior design. <laughs> good thing she changed too. I was going to say those coconuts would work up a hell of a rash, I imagine. Go on, Riley. Go, go on, feel the burn. Just like those people back at your house. You know what? Now that I've done three reps, I've realized I don't like working out and I'm going to go home. <laughs> That's this year's workout taken care of. Goes to the gym to just watch TV. Oh, I just had a hell of a workout. Just went down to the gym, watched some of that cooking show that I love. Whew, am I pooped? Who are you and why did you copy my hairstyle? You look exactly the same as me from behind. Good thing I have that face makeup on so you can tell who's who from the front. Look how innocent she looks. Like, I didn't burn the house down. <laughs> 
I'd say blame Mickey. I'm so glad I had to run this on a virtual machine. It did legit take me hours to get this working and a virtual machine was the only way it worked. But it's kind of great because it emulates how badly my computer used to run The Sims 2. Oh, we're almost loaded in though. I can hear the fire. <laughs> Oh yeah, here we go. Okay, it's taking a lot to load this all in, but I kind of understand there's a lot going on here. Phew, that was a close one. All right, well, I guess I can sell that smoke alarm now because what are the odds of having a fire twice? <laughs> Impossible. Riley, here, I brought... Oh my God. <laughs> what happened to the coconuts? Oh. <laughs> Wait, what? She gave me a gift and then she flicked my nose. I don't like her at all. Another coffee machine? <laughs> I guess I'll just put it on the other counter. <laughs> Wait, I just realized... Oh, no, she didn't move the furniture back. I was like, did someone break in and move all my furniture? I did that to my parents' house once. I just hopped in. They weren't there. So I just moved things around, like, slightly. Not enough to notice. Just, like, move the couch, like, a few inches. Like, swap shoes around, that kind of thing. <laughs> just to mess with them. It looks like this date is going pretty well. We're on a date? I'm sitting alone drinking from a can <laughs> without a table. And they're having a date, if anything. If anything, I'm third wheeling in my own house. And look, they're having a great time. They're accomplishing goals and everything. And I'm there in the kitchen alone like, yep, <laughs> this date's going well. All right, I'm going to charm him. I've worked up enough liquid courage here after drinking all that. Oh, this is working. Oh, God, she's pissed. She started poking him with a dart. Careful, please, lady. Jesus. If that's my aunt, I'm going to be pissed. It's saying time to hit on him. And I did, but it didn't work. Uh, do I actually have to hit him? Is that what she wants to do? Bye, he said. Okay, I think I can only get pity company out of him. So I'm going to light my house on fire again. Wait, they're hanging out in my garden. Dude, you can't just say bye and then hang out with her in my garden. At least go somewhere else. I'm here eating a two-day-old burnt grilled cheese <laughs> with no table. And I don't even have a change of coconuts. It's so uncomfortable. He's after coming back in. I think he has has a bit of personality like he's becoming sentient and he wants to go but the game's like sorry man you're kind of the next goal that weirdo in the kitchen with the coconuts has to hit on you i made everyone spaghetti so that they might like me more i made more spaghetti this one's floor spaghetti in case you're into that i don't know do some cultures eat off the floor probably please just love me dude please oh he's liking this animal noises <laughs> that bodes well for me i don't have much of a personality so if i can just sit there maybe making animal noises and you enjoy it, it, it's very good news. If you open relationships and go to the chemistry tab, there's no one. No one has chemistry with me. Uh, there's a fire in the background speaking of chemistry. <laughs> oh, he, he loved my joke. I hope you laugh like that sometimes. Can I do anything else uh, to get this? Because it's not working. Improve your relationship. The option to hit on Mickey will appear under the flirt menu. <laughs> Oh god, he loves me. He thinks I'm hilarious. Or else he's screaming because of the fire. Anyway, Mickey, I best get some sleep. <laughs> I'll talk to you tomorrow if you stay here in my house, which you probably will. My ground spaghetti is on fire! <laughs> oh no, it's spreading to the floor, spaghetti! Somebody save my spaghetti! <laughs> Why are you not saving it? Okay, she ran out. Probably a good idea. And he is standing very, very close to the fire. <laughs> okay, he's leaving. Phew! I can invite him back tomorrow and try and continue this little story mission I'm on, <laughs> trying to hit on him. And hopefully she won't come this time. It'll just be him. Well, wow, look at the time. I better continue what I'm doing at a more respectable hour. What, sleeping? I'm very hungry, but the kitchen's on fire, so I can't get anything. Oh no, I'm on fire. There's no one here to save me. Why is this happening to me? <laughs> She's just on fire. Oh no. Am I just gonna lose now? <laughs> Can I just stop being on fire, please? I've canceled the action. Could you stop being on fire? Oh, I think she he sneezed. Bless you. Great. I've died. It just says expire <laughs> on the next thing that my sim is doing. Expire. Oh, he's making a few calls. Maybe he can get me back or something. I, I don't know. Do you have the power? Just give me a chance. Come on. I just wanted to flirt with Mickey and it somehow ended up with me burning the house down. Sorry, but the story cannot continue when one of its main characters is pushing up daisies. It's not that kind of soap opera. <laughs> Reloading your last save. <laughs> Okay, we're back to where the firefighters are just leaving. Great. <laughs> Can you just stay, please? <laughs> Hit him quick while he's not looking. Oh, he's leaving again. Why do you always leave? Come back. And why do you leave her behind? <laughs> she follows you around, but when you're leaving my house, she doesn't. 
Who is calling me? It's not even my house. Leave me alone. How do you have my home number and my mobile number? Feck off, Fiona. I don't want to talk to you. Oh my God, he's back. You're giving me such mixed messages, dude. And I don't even mean in a romantic way. It's just you say you got to leave and then you're walking back into my house unannounced. Maybe he was just trying to lose the other one. Yeah, I mean... It's probably not that, but it makes me feel pretty good. So I'm going to go with that. Hit on. Yes. Okay. Now just get through all these because we have awful chemistry. So I got to be well beyond the point of unlocking the interaction to do it. Yes, it did it. Okay, you can go now. Wait, what is this? Dude, watch the coconuts, lady. <laughs> I think Riley's crying off camera. Wait, why are you hugging now? Why would you hug her after she just ran into the house and pushed me? Irritate. Yeah, gross out. That'll show her. Okay, that'll show her. <laughs> fight. Yeah, can we straight up fight? There we go. Be careful who you push back. I'm an arsonist. I'll burn your house down. Don't think this is over. You haven't heard the last of me. I don't even know your name. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know what your problem is. That'll teach you to mess with Riley Black Eye Harlow. <laughs> I can even tell if you have a black eye. You've got all that makeup all over you. Please, let the next goal be light the house on fire. I'm really good at that one. Oh, she's starving. Just eat the grilled sandwich. The one that stayed on that hob for days. Just burned to a crisp. I think that would just be the equivalent of eating ash. <laughs> <laughs> she's entered her little diary entry. I like how she sees herself as this, by the way. She's forgotten that she doesn't look like that anymore. She called the lady a stupid cow <laughs> in her diary. Is she like 12? But you're still here? Dude, it's 10 p.m. and I've been asleep for three hours. <laughs> He's really weird. I don't know why they're all into him. Like, I'm getting serial killer vibes. And if anyone would know, I would. Because I play the sims a lot not is there anything else that's what you mean i don't know why you're insinuating that that's weird of you i'm getting serial killer vibes from you to be honest <laughs> What? Why are you coming in and laughing when I'm trying to sleep? He just came in and laughed. He's insane. All right, I'm going to get up and make some spaghetti in the middle of the night and then forget about it and burn the house down. But I'm going to block the door this time so I'm safe. Oh, no, I just made spaghetti. I forgot about the fire part. Oh, now he's eating my spaghetti. He's such a weirdo. Okay, I think I've blocked every entrance to the kitchen and I left the food on the hob, so we should be good now. Oh, and some bathroom spaghetti. Okay, good, I'm saved. I just clicked on it to see if it was cooking and it came up extinguished before the fire even started. And I was like, oh, okay, it is working. Oh, this bath is so warm. <laughs> My aunt is going to be so pissed when she gets home <laughs> and realizes that, well, she doesn't have a home anymore. <laughs> the fire is actually so calm when people aren't screaming and stuff. Oh, she's realized there's a fire now, but she can't get to it. Good, good, good. Just go relax. Go relax on the bed. Great, great job. Work is in an hour, then we're out of here and we'll just let the fire tire itself out. Off to work you go. <laughs> she's like, look, Riley, it's your first day. Don't panic. The fire will be here when you get back. You can take care of it then. The goal are so far behind. It's like, I'll hang out with him a bit longer and then say goodnight. There's a lot to do, but he's he's gone. It's the next day. <laughs> oh, look, the fire did take care of itself. I told you. There we go. Fire's gone. Not to worry. I'm spending all my money getting ourselves a new kitchen and putting it in the living room. Let me just save the game before I cook because, well, that was a very, very successful fire. This whole Agora problem really has me tense. I think I'll give Fiona a call. We don't even really know Fiona. I don't know why we're relying on her. We're getting to know Mickey quite well. Still absolutely zero chemistry, but at least we know each other <laughs> on a first name basis. I didn't even know who the other lady was. All right, I like my burgers well done. So let's just, uh, let's just walk away from this. Create a little blockade here. The fish will be the first to go, I think. Put the fish next to the oven. <laughs> I don't need my aunt's bed either. I don't think she's ever coming back. So I'll just stack that up to my aunt's dressing table. Uh, the shower, I do not really need anymore. This chair also, and this barbecue. This easel, I hate painting. It makes me feel bad because I have no skill whatsoever. Yeah, we're gonna add like little bits of detail, I think. Okay, great. Everything valuable and ugly is put into this corner, except for me. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I'm trapped. I have built a fort. <laughs> uh, people do that when their, like, relatives are away, right? You build a fort. It's like I got the house to myself. Let's build a fort. I would do that if I had time. Oh, there starts the fire. <laughs> All right, well, I'm just gonna sleep through the whole thing. This isn't really what I pictured when I said Sims story mode, but at the same time, I'm not really surprised. <laughs> oh no, my barrier is gonna burn next. I wanted that, I wanted the computer. I think that might be a vital object. I feel like I've lost a lot of vital objects. My goals, buy a refrigerator. I don't actually have the money. She's a pyromaniac. Like she knows what'll happen if she gets near a fridge or cooker again. I think I'll keep the living room toilet. I actually kind of like that. I'm very hungry. 
again. I have no way of feeding myself. Oh, what's this? Save? Yes, save me. Oh, thank goodness. I'm saved. Phew. <laughs> I just saved the game and it feels like I'm in an impossible situation now. Like, how am I going to live? She's having a breakdown because of the ash now. <laughs> she actually wants to try and clean it. No, I like it. It's a cool style. She picked it up and then just threw it back down. Could I call some pizza? Or like call someone to deliver a pizza, not like actually call a pizza. Yes, there we go. Pizza boy. $40? That's like half my net worth. Yeah, sure. Except delivery. And hey, could I like ask you something? How did you cook this without burning your house down? Where's she gonna bring it? She's bringing it into the bathroom. <laughs> this is just sad. Well, look, it's something. You're not gonna starve anyway. And look, there's no shame in it. I've eaten pizza in a bathtub before. I was super drunk, but look, it happens, doesn't it? <laughs> We've all been there. What do you mean you haven't been there? You're a liar. We've all been there. Oh my god, she just stole my newspaper. I was gonna make a paper airplane out of that. There we go. Nice day at work. 240 bucks. That's a few pizzas. That'll keep me going. I need to get Dylan off my mind. Who is Dylan? <laughs> I know what to do. I'll invite Mickey to dinner at the Starlight Cafe. That should keep my mind off old memories. <laughs> I mean, it might keep your mind off the old memory of burning your aunt's house down. She's gonna be pissed. All right, you know what? I think that's a good place to end. We're at a very good spot right now. If you want to see more, do let me know. I would be down to ruin Riley's life a little bit more. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you. And I hope to see you next time. Bye for now.